Hello, and welcome to Cecily and Henry's Film Corner, where we talk about your favorite movies. And today we're going to be talking about a whole bunch of movies, starting with one of the biggest budget movies that's ever been made. It's Avatar. Ooh. Yeah, James Cameron. And um, this is a lot of uh, hype about this movie, and it's one of the biggest budget movies, as I said. Uh, now, Cecily, you're diminutive. Hmm. You're a short uh, person, or little person, I guess you'd say. I'm 5'2". Actually, I'm five two. Yeah, yeah, very small person. So I was curious to ask you, what did you think of the special effects? I thought they were really good. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm actually just a little confused why you brought up my size. Well, this is the way you see the world, and 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 uh, yeah. that's your perspective. It, just, it doesn't and, seem to m- yeah. seem like it would. Um, I thought the special effects were great. Me too. I think we should move on to the next sure, movie. Sure. Um, and that is Robin Hood. Ah, yes. It's uh, a remake, of mm-hmm. course, this time with Russell Crowe instead of Kevin Costner. Yeah, very different approaches. Uh, yeah. yeah, very different. And Henry, as a broke person, as a, a very oh. poor, someone who doesn't have a lot of money, um, and, you know, as someone who lives in a very, very small apartment, well, did efficient. You... It's affordable. Right. Yeah. Sure. Um, did you like Russell Crowe? Well, uh, I mean, yeah, obviously I, I like Russell Crowe. I, I, I don't know that it has anything to do with my financial Well, I mean, in this part, but, yeah. in, this, in this role. Well, I mean, I, I think that he took a very different approach to Kevin Costner. And, yeah. But I, I, I like Russell Crowe. I always have. Anyway, sure. let's move on to the next movie here. Uh, let us talk about... One of the most talked about movies, this is the Facebook movie, Social Network. Oh, one of my yeah. favorites. Very dry, very intelligent movie, and a little bit controversial. Now, here's my question to you, Cecily. As as an unmarried, barren, short Jewish person, uh, did you like the cinematography? I really don't see what my, my cultural background has to do, or the fact that I... Well, meaning this is the way you see things, this is what you bring to the table when you watch, you know, from your perspective, I guess. Right. Yeah. I thought that the cinematography was adequate. Me too. I thought it yeah, was Yeah, I really good. did think so. Let's wrap this up. I oh, think sure. we're almost yeah. out of time. Yes. Um, one of, I think, the best movies of all time, 35th anniversary, um, re-release of Jaws. Oh, yes, a classic. Yep, really. Mm-hmm. One of Spielberg's best, I would say. I think it changed film. I do too. Mm-hmm. Um, Henry. Yes. Uh, as an alcoholic, oh. as... Um, as someone who is very sexually confused um, and uh, socially awkward, pretty hmm. socially awkward, did you like Jaws? I don't know that my whatever issues that I, and struggles that I've had with my personal life have much to do with. Well, uh, you, you, know, you know, just as someone who you know just refuses to see the take the steps. Yeah, yeah, I I, I see. Um, well, I mean, I just don't see the like. For example, you're gay. No. Well, you're a lesbian or whatever. No, I'm not. Well, you swing that way, I guess is I what don't. I'm saying. You're a bisexual. No. Okay, well, you're you're gay. But as a gay woman, did you like the shark? I did. I did. Um, I'm not I'm not gay. I think that's pretty much our time. Okay. Uh, I All think right. uh, please join us next week when we talk about Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. Ah, yes. 